The Gilman Methodist Church is for sale after more than a decade without a congregation. Church leaders are being picky about who they sell it to, but they think they may have found the right fit. Channel 3's Rachel Mann spoke with them and the potential buyers. It was an extraordinarily difficult decision to decide to sell this church. Uh, but it had to be done. Debbie Thomas is a trustee for the Gilman Methodist Church. They say maintaining the building just became too expensive, so they listed it for what she says was a high price. Thomas says they had several interested buyers, including one who flew up from Pennsylvania, offering close to asking. And we made the decision that we wanted this church to remain a, a chapel, that this was the right thing to do and the right use for this building. So we declined that offer. That's when the American Legion stepped in with a plan to make the building a non-denominational church and community space in honor of Reverend George L. Fox. Fox served as a minister at the church and was already decorated from World War I. Then um, when the Japanese uh, bombed Pearl Harbor, uh, George said to his wife Isidore, he said, I have to go back. Those men are going to need me. But tragically, Fox went down on the USS Dorchester in 1943, along with 902 other servicemen, after he and three other chaplains on board gave up their life vests. Rabbi Good did not look for did not look for a Jewish soldier. Um, you know, George Fox did not look for a Methodist soldier. It was really um, it was really a selfless act. He was, from everything that I've heard, he was kind and generous and a man of faith. Despite the church's trustees not looking to profit on the project, it still isn't cheap. They're only asking the Legion to cover the cost of maintenance and the sale, but they'll have to invest more after assuming ownership. It needs a new roof. It needs handicapped access. It needs new bathrooms. It needs a lot of work. This is a piece of Vermont's history that we cannot let go. The American Legion needs $30,000 to buy the building and even more than that to make necessary repairs. Information on how you can donate will be on our website, WCIX.com. In Gilman, Rachel Mann, Channel 3 News.